that's the TV and that is the universal remote so we're going to program this remote hopefully to work for that TV if you knew the code which I don't for this TV you would hold push and hold setup till the power light turns red then you pick which one of these buttons you want TV cable DVD audio so I would push TV and then I would type down here the four digit code that goes with the TV uh, like say it's one 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 then oh that's supposed to turn off I don't know okay then then you would start controlling your TV and it would work great but I don't know the code so we're gonna do the auto setup so let's turn on the power for the TV Okay, that was the power button. We're going to have to do that again during the process. Let's try to do this quick. Okay, so again, we're going to push setup. Hold it down until that turns red. The TV's on. So we're going to, now instead of doing, okay, we're still going to push the thing we want to push here, I think. Now, we're going to hold down the power button for a second. And it flashes. It's trying out 10 codes at a time. It has all these codes stored. It didn't, we, we want the TV to turn off, so we're gonna do it again. It's flashing, and the TV's not turning off, so we're gonna do it again. Uh, nothing, try again. Hopefully we get it soon. You just keep doing that because it's trying out every code. Oh, look, it turned off. That's what we want. Okay, now the next step. So the next step is we turn on the TV again. I think this is so we can figure out which of those 10 codes actually worked. Like it tried out 10 codes at a time. Now we need to narrow it down to the, the good code, the one. So now TV's on. Now we're strangely, we're going to push the volume up button and we're going to wait like three seconds between every press. So I press it up. Did that turn off the TV? No. Again. No. Again, volume up. No. Again. No. I'm going to wait a few seconds. Oh, turn it off. Okay, so now the next step is I think it is that we just push again the button associated with the category TV and we're all set if this really worked this power should turn on the TV by itself now yep it worked and let's see if uh, try some different things the volume works does the channel thing work I don't know if you can tell that what about input Oh look, we can have access. So this, okay, you didn't see that. Okay, this looks like it's giving us full access to the TV for the most part. I, so far, I've been able to do volume. Let's turn off the TV, let's see power off works. Yep, powered off the TV. So this old Panasonic TV, this universal remote that was about $10 plus or minus, now has full control. This can control four devices, but the TV is set to this TV. And without knowing any codes or anything, I was able to use auto setup to get the TV to be controlled by the remote. And thank you for watching.